Hello, 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 and welcome to another episode of Crazy Town Gaming. My name is Jonas. I'm your host, and I'm here with TNT Dynamite, the explosive one. Jonas, you're the man on the sticks. I do have the sticks. And we're playing Mad 19, darling cheeks. Dar is, is that... Do you ever call? Yeah. Have you ever called anyone Darlin Cheeks? Uh, you know, if somebody deserves it, maybe she'll get. Wow, what's it. the situation that Darlin Cheeks is? Ooh, I don't know, <laughs> but if anybody, if there's any takers, please, I'm lonely. All right, all right, <laughs> we're playing that Mad Nineteen relocated franchise of the Toronto Mounties. We uh, plan offense only. Simming that D. Simmed up D. And we're using that balanced playbook, of course. Yeah, you know. We're, we're fucking cruising along. There's the hooker on the team. You say that every time. Yeah, I know, because he's on there every time. Poor Malik. Poor, he's, poor Malik. He's just trying, just trying to live his life. How many times that's been said in life? Poor Malik. Oh, damn it, Malik. What are you doing? He's all out there pimping himself out for the greater good of Chicago. Just out there just slamming ham with anyone. Slamming ham with the locals. <laughs> Do you ever slam ham, Jonas? Slam Man, <laughs> you a ham slammer? A, a, a ham slammer? <laughs> yeah. Um, what is the technical definition of? I don't know. Ham? It's a fucking Jonas term. <laughs> it was a joke I heard when I was like eight. There was a slammed ham joke you've heard. It means a fuck. I think it means fucking. So if that if just if it just translates to having sex, then yes, I've had sex before. I'm not a virgin. You've had intercourse. Breaking before? news: Jonas is not a virgin. <laughs> Jonas has had intercourse with a woman. Shh. <laughs> I don't want to give away all my secrets. Fucking crazy, man. Or just, yeah. with, or just with your hands. You've never had the intercourse with a woman? I'm a virgin. Oh, I knew it. I've There's never. nothing wrong with being a virgin, folks. Abstinence is bliss. Yeah, dude. <laughs> TNT, be a virgin like TNT Dynamite. TNT abstinence, Mike. It's okay, kids. I guarantee you. Asexual. Save myself till marriage. Yes, because that's on its way for you. <laughs> <laughs> Oh shit! Jones, have we talked? I feel like we've talked about marriage, but fuck it, we can talk about things multiple times. Oh shit! Got it. Ooh, oh, holiday! Hill and Myers, like I learned my lesson from being out there, <laughs> and I was sad, and I fumbled, and you Why know, is he gay? I reflected. <laughs> that's what? not a that's not a gay voice. It's this pondering internal clock. Why is he effeminate? <laughs> it's not effeminate, dude. <laughs> a little bit. Okay. You're like, I was okay. out there and I was like, fuck, that's, dude. That's I was like, oh. That's better. Okay, that's what he was like. But now he's redeeming himself. I don't mind us having a gay quarterback, Jonas. I just want to put that out there. You're, I'm fine. You mind? I don't. Said? I said oh, I okay. don't mind if we have like, a gay quarterback. I thought you were gay shame, and I'm like, dude, he's. he's gay, I'm not a gay show. I don't know what he does. And his, I know a lot about the team because I'm the owner. But, you know. Jonas, so we're there. We're oh yeah, you were talking we're about talk you said something about marriage. And you yeah, stopped. Jonas, I, how do you feel about marriage, man? What's your what's your I take was, on marriage? I've I've done it before. You, Jonas, has been married. I have. Yep. Um, I mean, how'd that go for you? Uh, I'm not married anymore. <laughs> how you tell me how that went. <laughs> I guess I'm a statistic, as uh, most of Americans who get married. <laughs> um, I mean. I guess I at some point would get married again, maybe. I don't know. I haven't thought about it, yeah. you know? All right, man. You know, keep hope alive over here, brother. I mean. I, TNT Dynamite has never been married. No, he is not. TNT heard. Dynamite doesn't believe in marriage. Ever? No, I don't I don't buy it, man. Until that point now where I just don't buy it. Wow. Nobody, nobody's giving me an argument strong enough for me to not to not buy like, it. Like, okay. here Here's, I, here, I guess, how I feel about marriage. It's like. You, the marriage itself, like being having a piece of paper, doesn't really change anything as far as like how you feel about the person and the bond you have and the trust and all yes, building that, a life and all that shit. That's that's my outlook on it. Yeah, I mean, so it's like, I just don't, I don't understand if if two people like each other, they spend time together. Right. Okay, great. Yes. We're boyfriend and girlfriend. We're living in the same house. We're basically playing marriage. Yeah. And then you're like. Hey, could you sign this contract? <laughs> People get married for the perks, like sharing insurance. Oh and well, yeah, that's, things like that. Yeah, that's super fucking romantic. Thanks. I'm glad you could <laughs> fucking get you married. You my health insurance, dog. <laughs> yeah, I'm glad you can get married so you can get a discount on fucking tires at Walmart. It's, 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 yeah, that's not that's not what oh, a relationship. Oh shit! 
That's not what a relationship should be built on. It shouldn't be built on the inherent fear tactics that are utilized through that contract. Because if the two people decide that they do not want to be together, yes. why should we make it legal red tape? I understand that marriage is forever, but it should be an internal, an internal commitment. Yeah. Not enforced by law. Boom, dynamite drop microphone. I'm Bam! He's like he's like motherfucking Louis C.K. folks, I'm minus the assault here. charges. Yeah, I stopped looking at Reddit to get that out. <laughs> you did. <laughs> I did. What do you mean? You pay one hundred percent attention to me. I've been paying attention to the conversations that were I know, right? Uh do what? no man, I'm the man on the sticks. Doesn't matter if you watch or not. You're here you're here for the commentary. No, I watch I watch when you're doing something great. Like watch this. I'm watching right now. Here it comes. This dude is fucking easy mode. You're just going to juke him and then you're done. Oh, God. <laughs> Why did you run that way? <laughs> oh, shit, I wanted to, like, showboat a little bit. <laughs> and look at what it got you. Uh, tackled. Yeah, man. So, you know. in that case, man, I don't think I'll ever get married in the conventional sense. You said, I'm, would you say Oprah? If Oprah came? I would marry Oprah. But then again, I would only be marrying her for the perks. What's the perk? Uh, she's fucking rich? What are you talking about? <laughs> Not to mention that she is a beautiful woman. We yeah. don't want to. We don't want to take that away okay. from her. She's like sixty, but she's still. She's a hot sixty. A hot sixty. Yeah, what does but that entail. <laughs> what's a hot sixty entail? What do you mean? What is a hot sixty? What's What's a hot sixty compared to a not hot sixty? Uh, I don't know. Like most of you motherfuckers' grandparents are not hot sixties, and then like. Some people are hot 60. So, like, rich 60 that can, like, afford to you stay. Know, money is super sexy, but I just mean, like, appearance-wise. Money is super sexy. Appearance-wise, she's a hot 60. Who else is a hot 60? Fucking Jennifer Lopez is a hot 60. She's 60? She's yeah. up there, man. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, fucking, uh, who's the one who showed her, her breast at the Super Bowl? Janet Jackson? Hot 60. Is she 60? She's getting there, man. Mariah Carey. <laughs> I think you're naming people who are in their 50s. <laughs> oh, they just deflected it and Barkley caught it for a nice. touchdown. He does everything, folks. Ooh, he is a little infeminate. Look at the way he's running. <laughs> <laughs> wow. You're judging a, a book by his cover, friend. He might be a little sweet. I'm all right with that, he though. He might be a little sweet. <laughs> That's okay. It's fine. Dude, dude, it's fine. We're all a little sweet. We're all a little sweet. Yeah, but you know, I mean, hot sixties. What it like? Do you feel like you'd miss out if you never got married ever? You missed out on what? Life. What, what is there? I don't know. I'm just asking is, question. Oh well, there really. I don't is, have any special meaning to it. There really is no difference to the life of a married person or the life of a person that's chosen chosen to like move in and live with a female. That's true. I just feel like that commitment. Should, oh, those guys moved at the same time. Did yeah, you see it? like the game's jank and it does like the same, <laughs> the same anime. They'll all be like clapping in unison on the <laughs> sideline, lift their arm up at the same time. They're all like androids. <laughs> yeah, I, yeah, Jonas. I don't know, man. I, I will definitely consider incorporating another human being into my life for the rest of my life. I'm cool with that. Yeah. I think the the important thing is that you got to remember the relationship and the connection with that person is what matters, and it's not about the paper or the ring. I would be more than willing to conform to the societal norms of getting the ring okay. and having the ceremony, but not doing the paperwork. That's just it's stupid. Yeah, it's man. Stupid. I, uh, why, why we got to turn this into a business arrangement? Yeah, right. Right. Look. No, man, I think, like, yeah, I feel like you can have the same level of commitment whether you're married or not. Yeah. And that, it, it's not it's not the status quo, my methodology of thinking. No, Don't get not. me wrong. It is not the status quo, but. Yeah, I guess, like, at this point, I'm just, like, indifferent. Like, if, if I was with someone and they wanted to get married and we were together and we, like, blah, 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 like, I would consider it. But, like, it's not, like, it's not like I'm, like, I need this to happen in my life. I need to, like, mm -hmm. X, Y, Z to oh. feel like I'm. Oh, look at Hillenmeyer. Yeah, I don't. <laughs> I, 
I just see the, the, you look at the rates, man, the divorce rates, and millennials are killing marriage anyway. Wow. They are. Are they? Not everybody else? No, I mean, look, you're looking at one right now, and he ain't doing that shit. So <laughs> well, yeah, go. I guess I'm looking at a millennial. <laughs> I'm a statistic. The oldest millennial in the world, Jones, millennial look. Jackson. Not know. quite the oldest, but close. I don't know why you hate it. Ooh, <laughs> he's got it, folks. <laughs> Russell's hustling. Oh, man, he's taking that ball home with him, apparently. He is. <laughs> He He's all like, I got go. a special pillow for it. It's going to sleep next to me on the old bed. <laughs> oh, shit. He earned that, though. That was a nice catch. I don't, know, I don't know the frame that he caught it in. Oh, you know. Because it went from air to in his pocket. Nah, dude, this game isn't jank. This game is pretty freaking jank. I've seen some really jank glitches from it on uh, like the PC version and shit. Oh, yeah, dude. Some of, the, some of it's real bad. Yeah. I've seen like guys hovering and like body parts spinning. Yeah, it's like that. It's like I always go back to the UFC game. That like they go to lock up mm -hmm. and they just helicopter into the air. Like I haven't seen any of that. Oddly enough, in any of this, stuff. both are made by EA. Oh yeah, we'll go go to figure, and they keep coming out with them every damn year. Yeah, they do. And they just keep getting worse. Yeah, you know, not <laughs> everything gets better with age, man. Yeah. Yes, I, honestly, I hate the whole idea of games as a service, which is essentially when they sell you a game and then they sell like add-ons to it. Yes, but well, for well, games a, used to be complete. Yeah, yeah, and there was no DLC, no day one DLC. Yeah, day yeah, right. Like that just seems like something they left out the game to yeah. charge you extra. Why did you take that out of the game? <laughs> I feel you, dude. Like, I've, why? And I've seen, uh, I even saw, like, a, a meme where it was, like, a guy, and he took a game. Or he took, like, a game on a disc, and Ooh. he broke it into, like, four different pieces. Yeah. And he was like, here's the game, and he only hands you half of the disc, and he's, like, DLC. He writes that on half of it. He's like, he's like I'll give you the other part for <laughs> Yeah. That's pretty funny, to be honest. <laughs> yeah, dude, I don't, I don't quite get... It's like it's like they everyone's money hungry everywhere. So it's like, yeah, you know, and it's proven that you can put out a full game and support the game for free and still make money. Yeah, like Overwatch, like yeah. Fortnite. I mean, what? Overwatch is a full game. You have to buy it, but they support it with free content. Yeah, they have a what you call it. They have like. Microtransactions, but it's all for aesthetics. There's yeah. no... The loot boxes are all aesthetic. Yeah, it's like people want to support the game. They're like, you know what? This is a quality game. I'll give you 10 bucks. Like, I'm, I'm actually kind of mad that they're trying to get in Overwatch's pocket so heavy, too. Because they're trying to, like, outlaw loot boxes. Well, yeah, then they'll stop putting out free content, and then they'll charge for DLC. Yeah. They'll be like, it. you want the new character? 10 bucks. <laughs> no, they better not charge me 10 bucks for it, man. That shit's just so lame. That's yeah. kind of what killed Destiny, though, is the loot boxes. It did? I thought the uh, shitty game killed it. <laughs> <laughs> no, man, when they started putting shit behind paywalls and shit, I, I was definitely they, I turned off. I thought the off. only thing you could buy in Destiny's loot boxes was you could buy armor, but it was like zero level armor. You had to, like, level it up or whatever. Yeah, but mean, it didn't have gr better skills or anything. I don't know. I When it went from the shaders that you could just equip to, to the fact that you had shaders that had a number like shaders were like a consumable I have to admit I was pretty mad about that. Yeah dude it. I mean the game just turned into vomit. Yeah. They took that whole Eververse thing and just they kind of ran with it. They're was, like look how much money we're making. <laughs> I know. It's <sighs> unfortunate. I miss Destiny you, 1 though. Oh uh, dude I loved that game so much. It was fun. It was fun. You know, I love fun games. I do, too. Destiny was one of those. We're almost done with Red Dead, man. So what do you think we should play next? Destiny 2. No, you play Destiny 2. I will never do that. All right. I bought it and played it through the first story and then never touched it again. Basically the same thing. I grinded it for five seconds. I was like, oh, dude, I did things. Uh, I played it for like a couple weeks, and then I was just like, "This is not as fun." Yeah, we played it together because we were like, we would like uh, grind public events. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like, oh boy, we just drove around for an hour doing the same thing. I know, right? And then I was like, "Hey, Overwatch." Yeah, dude, this, you know this what? This game inher is inherently fun. Yeah, when they when they did that year one to year two kill all the guns immediately thing, and I put all that time into year one, it really hurt it for me. Like that was the beginning of the end in my book. No. No, that didn't really affect me. I still played a lot after Year that. Year two was fun. 
I played all the way through year three. I played year three, too. I didn't play... Oh, my God! Ooh, he's dropping it like it's hot, folks. What is he doing? He, I don't know. He what did the, dance is that? I don't know. It's the spinny drop bottom. <laughs> he was definitely... Doing, what? That guy just disappeared. Yeah, dude. Thanos snapped his fingers, and that guy didn't yeah, feel dude, so you, good. You know how that works in real life. You just snap your fingers, and you teleport. That's what Thanos does. Yeah, he whipped... Then he nanaed. Jonas, I want to go see that Spider Verse. Let's go see Spider Verse tomorrow. Spider Verse? Yeah, the Spider Man movie. Right, we, we have to do more recording. <laughs> <laughs> like, Spider Verse will be there and has been there for weeks. I know, but you're it's off all go day. Away. Go see it while I have to do my side hustle. Oh my god, yeah, I might do that. That's and there'll be nobody in the damn theater when you go watch it. That's either. a good point. I know you hate everyone <laughs> except for me. <laughs> So, oh, he still hate me. I'm he still hate you, me too. I'm glad you know that I don't hate you. <laughs> I figured. <laughs> I'm glad you. I mean, know. I don't know for sure. I just well, assumed I was good. being that, ignorant. That, that means I'm doing it right. Yeah, right. I'm like, <laughs> eh, he might hate me. I'm not sure if he hates me or not, but, but he hasn't tried to kill yeah, me today. Yeah, I mean, you talk about killing me, but just haven't done it yet. <laughs> Talk about sneaking, <laughs> sneaking in my room and slitting my throat and all. Listen, wait a minute. This is all jokes. But it is. It is all jokes. It's but I have st stood outside of a couple of people's bedrooms with, like, <laughs> a large axe in my hand. And I've just contemplated, like, how my life would change. Why do you have to have the axe to contemplate that? Oh, he pushed him down <laughs> like he's a bitch. Yeah. <laughs> Oh, I jumped out at the one like a fucking cuck. <laughs> Good job. Yeah, dude. It's it, it's kind of like that moment in a video game where you make like that one decision that will change like the end of the game. It's yeah. like you're standing there with the axe and it's like, go into the room and kill Jonas or go make a sandwich. And you're like, sandwich every time. Like, I always pick sandwich. Because you're hungry. <laughs> because nobody wants to be the asshole. But it's like, if I pick that, man, the whole fucking, the whole choose your own adventure, bandersnatch, it's all different. It is. It, the whole thing is different. Like, that's the point where you try to tell that you're Netflix. Yeah, it turns from a sitcom to a fucking drama. Like a, a prison drama. <laughs> like a last action hero. Yeah, dude, it turns into 60 days in, but it's life in. <laughs> <laughs> oh, all of a sudden it's old brother where art thou yeah right you're on the run then you go to like and find some sirens in the yeah. wilderness and they yeah, get dude. you in trouble i'm not ready for that type of gameplay that emergent gameplay yeah dude i can't it's Ooh. too much god dude i hate life <laughs> why don't you just run it in dude it's like a half a yard dude i can't even pretend it's two centimeters yeah oh for whom the bell tells that's almost an inch is it? No. How many centimeters? Two and a half centimeters. centimeters in How do you know these things? Because I'm fucking awesome. How do you know math stuff? I'm deaf. Oh! There it is. Oh, let's dance a little bit. Oh, he's got. Why oh, are you okay. still rowing? He's still he's, trying to get home. Dude, he's wiggling a little bit, and I see it. Mm. <laughs> Don't you mm that? Dude, you know. What? If anyone was going to murder me. What? I would I would like it to be you. Jonas, I'm not going to murder you. <laughs> I don't want to be murdered. I feel like anything that I'm saying right now, it's I could like, be held culpable yeah, if know, your right? body were to be like, found. Like, if I do find, they, like, when they end up stabbed, they're like, on oh, episode <laughs> X of Crazy Town Media's exactly. YouTube channel, you were joking about, I mean, but if you didn't do it, they would find out you didn't do it. Jonas. It's not going to be an easy, like, it's not going to be like, well, I guess you didn't do it. Yeah, I already I live with you, so there's only going to be You're questions. You're already going to be the first suspect. Be like, yeah, well, he was found with an X, and it had TNT Dynamite <laughs> on the handle. <laughs> there, was a, there was a TNT Dynamite sticker on the X in his noggin piece. Get your TNT Dynamite stickers, kids, at a store near you. There is, if you, if you want to start those, we should. I don't want to start those. <laughs> oh, Jesus, I ran into everybody. I was like... Run into God Jones. I would like for one day for me to have stickers available, but... Uh, of your face? I don't know if the, the ten people who, who watch us are going to be buying those. By the way, I see you guys out there. Yeah, we like all of you. Very Name much. one. Name somebody that we see. Who? Name somebody. That we see watching us? Yeah. There's fucking Cynthia Ruthen. There's Cooper Swagger. Jonas, you're naming off the, the regulars. Name a deep cut. Give me a B-side. There was a... Uh, Nate Demand. Oh, big Nate. Yeah. Don't debate a, the Nate. Mick Pick. 
M I K P I K, Meek well, Peak, whatever. I'm not going to say that one. They, uh,. <laughs> They they said they liked the series. Oh and well, keep look, going. you see, Jonas remembers uh, you guys. I do too. Mr. They just uh, they just said there was a real banger down one of my Browns videos. Oh shit! That was uh, I don't remember the name exactly off the top of my head. Oh, that just means that you are a a bad man. I'm very very bad. I'm, I'm surprised bad you do person. not remember the names of every person you've ever met in life. I don't. I'm terrible with names though, so I'm really bad. That I'm, was a uh, I am too. PSM Caleb. He was like, "This is a banger." I was like, "Fuck yeah, it is." I'm trying to get better with remembering people's names. Uh, me, yeah. You know. Usually, usually I have to do it like uh like if I meet somebody IRL. It's also uh, Zach uh, Chase. He's a uh, he's a uh, he was a guy that liked the podcast. He he transferred over. Oh sweet. Awesome. Oh, mother effers. I find that it's hard to, like, if I, you tell me your name and I'm just meeting you and I shake your hand, usually that information is in one ear and out the other. So usually it's like the next time I see that person and I'm saying, what, what, what was your name again? I'm that guy. I'm the what is your name again guy. Because you have to, like, prove your <laughs> Yeah, I, I, um, my life. that happens to me all the time. Like, I mean, I go and play volleyball. And, like, there's a lot of people at volleyball. And I never forget your face. Like, if you've been there before, yeah. I remember you. But, like, don't ask me what your fucking name is. Now, some of the people I know, but I've been playing volleyball with those same people for, like, two years now. So, I remember their name. Like, but if I've only seen you there one time or two times, I'm not probably not going to remember your name. Hmm. You got to improve your importance. You got to prove you're, like, not even, like, beneficial, but. Like, your worth? Are you relevant? <laughs> is it relevant to remember your name? Because I've met a lot of people You can just be, life. like, that guy. Yeah. I guess, yeah, man, that's very true. So yeah, uh, you're gonna you're gonna have to tell me twice every time. Every twice every time. What's your name again, Jonas? Jonas. Okay, yeah. yeah. I figured as much. Yeah. Murdery. Really, should really commit that to memory. I'm the murdery. What is what is the murder e? The person the murderer murders. The murdery. The victim? The victim. Okay. That's no, that's uh Oh god, we have more hurt people. That's Chachmeyer. What? <laughs> Chachmeyer's the, the victim? Yeah, he's the victim. Oh Jesus, you're gonna kill Chachmeyer? <laughs> he is. He's a chronic victim. Oh uh, this... How did he drop that? Dude he bit he, him in the hands, man. He wasn't eating the syrup stick. Syrup sticks, huh? Yeah. Is that a Canadian? delicacy of some sort a syrup stick yeah i mean it I'm could wondering. be actually that doesn't sound too bad they have those honey sticks where you bite the end off and you oh, suck them like bit of honey <laughs> no no oh, no almost threw up my mouth. <laughs> no 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 they're oh my god seals jones dude oh bit of honey oh my Ooh. god bit of honey is so gross <laughs> Oh my god! From the color to the consistency to oh the my taste, God, dude, <laughs> there's nothing good about those things. No, no redeeming like qualities. Honey, I'm sorry. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry that you exist. Wow, what if like <laughs> what? What if like someone important to you likes bit of honey? Like who? Your mom. Well, if my mom likes bit of honey, of course I'm glad she exists. Yeah, see, you can't like. But she doesn't because she's a, she's a, she's a, 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 a very intelligent human being yeah, who would never a, like such a blasphemous candy. She's an affable female, so she would not like bit of honey. She knows better. Who's her shoulder tear? Jesus, Jonas, what the fuck is going on with your team, bro? Mine is like, nah, dude, I'm good. They're trying we're to going imp- for it. They're though. trying to impugn your progress here. Yeah, dude, we're trying to we're trying to win. They're not letting us win. And now it's the two-minute warning. Jonas, just don't get injured, forehead. I have a five-head, thank you. What? I wasn't, call- I wasn't calling you forehead. Oh. <laughs> uh, forehead is, is a twitch emote that says, like, like forehead. Oh, he left him in the dust, folks. Like Don v- oh, my gosh, he's hoking out. Dude, he's so angry. <laughs> now he's not. He's like, nah, dude, I'm good. I love the booze. It's beautiful. Where are we at? Oh, we're in the giant stadium. They're booing him. Yeah, oh, well, yeah. New Yorkers are quick to, to the fucking boo. <laughs> I'm surprised. If it were a real fucking uh, true to New York game, you'd hear so many fuck out of his. <laughs> fuck out of his. Yeah. Fuck out of here. I hear you. And everybody would have on Tim's. 
Oh my God, he's fucking open, it's folks. Not really. The surgeon. Was he open? Did you see him get nibbled on? I saw he him. was fucking crimson cutting. That means when he cuts it, the crimson comes out. That's at everybody. You want to watch it? It's it bounced off his hands to another hand into his hands. Watch. It bounced off his hands watch, into watch. another hand. One, two, three. I can't even see what's happening. It'll be closer this time. <laughs> no, it won't. <laughs> oh, these son of a bitch. It was very good. You I, missed it. I'll Thanks. trust it. I mean, Jonas, I don't really ever see where the ball is going. I know you don't. It's okay. Oh, it's the end of the game. We didn't even need to do anything else. Oh, well, shit. He's like, God damn it. Guess I'm moving to Jersey. Motherfucker, I wanted some waffles, and they told us they'd give us some if we won. Russell, he's hustling. There's Barkley. He's just becoming a one-man gang. Charles Barkley? Yes. Good game, Joe. Yeah, we won. We won by a lot. <laughs> we're the winners. Well, we scored 55 the last two games. <laughs> So we're actually underperforming. Don't worry, kids. Jones is going to take the difficulty up in the next episode. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> I'll be dead. That is all the time we have for today's episode. Please make sure to like, share, and subscribe. Don't forget to lie to your friends while you're at it and tell them we're worth watching because we know that you would be lying to them if you told you that. But for Jonas, TNT Dynamite. for TNT Dynamite, yeah. we are, are out.